Hello everyone, Susie Gaming here and welcome to Fly Out. Released mid-November this year, aircraft building game. Similar to simple planes, compared to it, graphics look much more realistic. It's also made by a solo dev. So yeah, I decided to try it out and even downloaded some player-made models. Let's check it out. So here we go. This is how it starts from the cabin and you have all of the parts here that you can combine even have some weapons agm 65 drum magazine flare dispenser gun hard point let's see how they look flare dispenser here hard point i have zero clue what the hell is that hard point tall oh, okay it's where you attach your missile okay ir missile air st pot rocket pot quite decent weaponry for an alpha game like compared to a Brick Ricks, this is already an improvement. Here are the joints, electronics, even a solar panel. That's probably... Oh, yeah, and by the way, you can build your own cockpit as well. Fuel dump, smoke pot, and looks like that's it. Oh, look at that bomber cockpit. What the hell? There's some interesting parts we have here. Already, you can stick this in the tip of the bomber. Here is the parameters of the single part. Oh, you can even bend it like this. This game, by the way, has a really complex building. So it's not going to be like Rick Ricks with a band like this. You can already imagine how complicated the builds will be. Open the wing editor. What the heck is wing editor? Sounds awesome. Look at this. You can freely bend plane parts. Now let's switch what you guys did game doesn't have workshop yet uh, later in the video i will explain how to get these planes into your game so you can try them out as well all of these things made by a player four of these are coming as a default all right let's start with the lockheed f-17 nighthawk beautifully done uh, i believe something happened to the paint shape looks good oh that's loud Okay, here it is. The Lockheed. Uh, the Nighthawk. So shift this thrust up. And I can't seem to stop it. So we're gonna have to take off. Let's do this. Full thrust. There we go. You can see the exhaust effect, looks cool. I'm pressing S and we're up. G to gear up, but gear up system doesn't work, looks like. And by the way, this game has some cool mechanics. Uh, your pilot can black out if you turn too much. Uh, you can see some detailed indicators at the bottom of the screen. Uh, v for the cockpit. Oh, okay. C for the follow camera. I was looking for that. Oh, flyby view. So like in War Thunder, you can get some cinematic shots. Uh. Okay, let's just crash like this. Boom. <laughs> Alright, that was a good landing. <laughs> Pilot survived. Uh, we have a 1990 Ferrari here. <laughs> he actually managed to make a car in an aircraft building game. Look how slick it looks, by the way. Let's test it out. Probably he used landing gear as wheels. Oh God. I hear a prop plane engine. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> Nothing happens when I press W. Okay. I forgot this is not a racing game. I need to press shift. <laughs> Still nothing happens. Wow. For a moment you gave me hope. <laughs> mm. 
Yuna's headlights? Wow, he animated that. Look at that. That's awesome. Here we go, we have the almighty bird plane. Right, start from the desert. Oh. Guys, for a moment, pause your screen and tell me this doesn't look like War Thunder right now. It looks exactly like War Thunder graphics. <laughs> what the hell? How is this possible? Here we go. Damn engine's too loud. Take off. Come on. Here we go. Landing gear works. Let's check out the cockpit. That's working indicators. Pretty simple. Also the bird cannon. All right, I noticed uh, that we have some options here. Even as autopilot, engage. Okay, let's check it out. You can select your weapons here. I'm just gonna select the anti-tank missile. You can see there's indicator popped up. Controls. Light. Some extra data here. Conditions. As I said, this game is really, really detailed. Spawn menu. Enemy Sam spawned. Tank. Target drone. Okay, now let's try to kill them. 30 kilometers away and as you can see screen can black out but apparently you do not lose your controls when your pilot blacks out uh, it just gets darker it automatically locks as soon as I aim kind of towards it it kind of goes down automatically so it's hard to keep it straight for some reason oh it's because flaps are on Oh shit, I accidentally launched it. Here we go, I fixed the flaps finally. But it still goes down. I'm gonna fire it when we're like 7 kilometers. Here we go. Oh shit. F. There it goes. So to fire ATGM, it's F. And to BIRT, it's space. Oh, there goes the AGM, I can see it. Oop. Almost there. And it's destroyed. What cool little explosion effect. I wonder what tank is that. Even if I set it to autopilot, it goes like a ship. So there's definitely some heavy weight at the tip of the nose there goes the drunken A-10 right let's see if we can even hit that there's no way I'm hitting it with this shake there is no way we're gonna have to be really lucky oh god yep yep <laughs> There is no way. Nope. What if I land next to it? Oh shit. That was not me. Okay. Yeah, this plane had some bad controls. So, zero out of ten. <laughs> Heavy bomber. Oh, 
I guess it automatically turns wherever the wind is facing or something. It should go straight. I'm fixing it myself. Okay, let's go. Take off. Uh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> Why gears are not working? Come on. Uh, no indicators at all. It's like a prototype plane or something. Or homemade plane. But yeah, looks good. Who does not like this shape anyways? Okay, let's crash, I guess. Feels like we're flying sideways. Yeah, we're flying sideways. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah, you can see some aerodynamic problems in this game. Alright, I'm doing a barrel roll in B2. Yeah, bad idea. We're poof disappeared cool Antonov 225 the hungry plane gear up ah, it doesn't work all right looks awesome there we go left wing touch I think we lost the lamp at the tip of it, that's it. <laughs> it. Feels like there is a resistance, it doesn't allow me to barrel roll. Okay, I'm going hard then. Oh! Still functional. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> okay. That was it. <laughs> awesome. Next plane BV 238. Holy shit. C-17 I wonder when they're gonna make the baby C-17 <laughs> Please somebody from the community do it We want a baby C-17 <laughs> Alright, for some planes, the landing gear is not working. I don't know the reason. Oh god. We're falling, we're falling, we're too heavy. <laughs> we're too chunky. Hmm? Cockpit. Looks a bit better compared to the others. Awesome. I'm gonna stop it with the drift. I can't wait. <laughs> it takes too long. <laughs> there you go. There you go. I guess there is no way to stop it then. <laughs> a literal piece of Dorito. <laughs> like the author published it as a literal piece of Dorito. That's why 
I added to this list. Surprisingly, flies really good. <laughs> I like how flaps literally next to each other. Imagine if like any engineer from Lockheed aircraft engineer getting inspired from this game and building something like this in real life use it in military this thing flies really good by the way i'm not even joking good controls i even can land it let's go oh shit yep parking brake parking brake <laughs> yes, successful landing. <laughs> there you go. Awesome creation. Oh, beautiful paint job. Look at this. It's animated. Like in War Thunder. Bam. Looks even better than War Thunders, to be honest. Not even lying here. Uh, gear up doesn't work. Gonna have to roll with it. Okay, let's shut that uh, drone, shall we? Aim round. I'm gonna use that. Let's spawn a uh, target drone. Space. R. R is for flare. Um, oh, that's cool. Whoa. Cobra maneuver. Went wrong. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, there's no recovering. <laughs> Want to recover. Oh, look at the trail I'm gonna nose dive then try to recover no I, I I lost the control completely damn it oh god <laughs> all right you know what we're gonna do oh shit uh, I'm gonna shut that drone with an F-22. Oh god. That looks like... Oh god. <laughs> awesome. Dude, the jet flame looks awesome. <laughs> that was almost a clear landing. Jet Flame looks better than War Thunder, so I'm not lying. Saves you from the grind as well. You can directly own a F-14. Even better, you can own an upcoming plane. Ah, beautiful, 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 beautiful. Oh my god. Well... <laughs> Whoa, easy, easy. Okay, whoa. Yep. <laughs> uh, something happened at the bottom of the plane, but I'm not complaining. It looks like some parts are missing even. <laughs> but anyways, okay. What weapons we have? No weapons? You serious? Alright. Uh, by the way, I would like to show you this detail. Engine's vectoring is working as well. You see how they're twitching? That's real life. Maybe that's why it's this maneuver. Here. Game's engine can't handle it. How maneuverable the F-22 is. Whoa! Easy. 
F22, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> we even have sci-fi crafts here. Let's test it out. So not only real life plays, you can build basically anything in this game. I believe this game will convert to brick ricks eventually. We might even see tanks in future. All right. Ooh, FPS drop is real. Jesus Christ. That's a lot of engines there. <laughs> Look how many engines are there. <laughs> Flaps. <laughs> oh god. And there's a turret. <laughs> you can click on the stuff, cut the fuel. That's awesome. Back to hangar. 162. The plane with the backpack, I believe. Yes. We have a short wing spam anyways. So we should go between them easily. Yep. Easy peasy. <laughs> Legs are sticking out. Well, or it's good for sure. Hard to control, hard to control. Oh. This one goes to Flight Simulator fans. The legend is back. <laughs> Please tell me this thing flies. Shit. <laughs> we have a hot air balloon 20 kilometers above. <laughs> It's a free fall. Right, that's enough. This one is really interesting. McDonald Goblin. This is a parasite fighter from World War II. This thing was launched from the Bombers Bay. Can this thing actually take off? Oh god. Already have some problem with the balancing? But maybe. Just maybe. Game is not ready for the goblin. Okay. <laughs> that was awesome. I want to try it again. Here we go. We're dropping. Cool cockpit. Oh, let's drop these things. Wow, that's awesome. This is the closest thing we're getting to baby C-17. Look how derpy how cute this thing is <laughs> little chunger <laughs> whoa that vapor <laughs> uh, no machine guns currently cannot fire it's unarmed real awesome awesome Whoa, Cobra Maneuver. 
bit hard to control, but not bad. <laughs> Love it. Definitely my favorite creation in this list so far. And again, it's really hard to believe Americans actually built this. <laughs> Messerschmitt BF 109. Some World War II classic, but without a paint job, apparently. And some censored symbols. Control is a bit bad. Barely can lift. Not maneuverable. We might even crash here now. Oh shit. <laughs> good bounce. Bounce is good. <laughs> oh, we lost the prop. Goodbye. <laughs> One eye. Right, bad plane. This was this was terrible. Oh god, we're <laughs> nose down. Oh, nose down. Oh shit, what the hell happened? Uh, like functionality wise, Brick Rick's currently is superior towards this game because helicopters there actually work. Right, let's. How to fire rockets? Oh, there it is. Oh, that's awesome. I love the explosion effects. Goodbye. I really want to fly a blackbird, but couldn't find it. There you go. That's awesome. Holy shit! Nope. Oh! For one second. Now we have SST-5. Okay, this one is a fictional aircraft. Uh, according to creator, it's the first jet in the game that can reach Mach 10. I don't want to take off, so I'll just max this out launch 50 kilometer altitude with the supersonic jet cannot gear up wow look at the wheel you know why there is no sound because we're in space that's cool uh, he said that it takes around 10 15 minutes to reach the mach 10 but i'm not gonna wait that long let's just nosedive i'm curious about these mountains let's explore them can slowly hear the engine Yep, I can hear it now. Did you hear that sonic boom? That was awesome. Again.
right, this one goes to Ace Combat fans. The fan rear. Now, if you don't know, this plane has a devastating laser cannon underneath it. Even though it doesn't look aesthetical, in the game it worked. <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. Okay, I'm gonna try to shoot down a drone. Damn, it's fast. Fire! There it goes. Bam! That was awesome. Smoke trail could have been longer, but maybe because it's performance issues. Oh, this plane is awesome. Yeah, this maneuverability is suitable to the Ace Combat, actually. Definitely. Imagine playing this online. Like, no grinding, guys. You can build any plane you want. You can shape it however you like. All right, and let's try to land this. Fire. Yeah, that worked. Successful landing. This one is kind of flying, but it's in the free fall. Oh, it's actually working. Yeah, it's in the free fall. Eh. You can see that supersonic vapor and just like in War Thunder, if you switch at this half of the plane, you cannot hear sounds because you broke the sound barrier. But behind it... Awesome. Let's get shot by it. Ooh. Mm. 
destroyed it. <laughs> yes. This plane is quite durable. <laughs> Griffin, let's try to shut down uh, a drone. Already did it, but wanna do. Oh shit! <laughs> Never mind, we're not doing anything. <laughs> what the hell was that? Okay. It doesn't like supersonic speeds. MK2, what the hell is radial? Oh, prop plane. Okay. What's gonna happen if we're gonna spawn it supersonic? <laughs> yeah, prop plane freaking out. Good maneuverability. <laughs> 10 out of 10. Great landing. <laughs> Alright guys, so that was Flyout. Definitely a game that has potential. Love the vapor effect. Love the afterburner, uh, just like a AAA game quality, and also love the explosions. Hope developer gonna add a workshop and keep improving this game. Maybe even add multiplayer someday. I'll drop the build links in the description if you wanna test them out yourself. Unzip them and you can test them out in the game. Thanks for watching. Tell me what you think about this game. But I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.